Hi guys, Tardash McGee, Stock Picking Genius here. Today I want to uh, talk about this uh, YouTuber, Financial Journey. So this guy, you know, he mostly talks about uh, Molin, a lot, mostly Molin. He talks too about Lucian and Rivian, right? Nothing bad about that, right? But there's one thing I just wanted to make aware to anybody who watches this guy's channel. <clears throat> he has been paid, or he has before been paid, and he has been several times paid to promote penny stocks. And a lot of times, he likes to be very deceptive with how he discloses it. Sometimes he just puts it in the description. Sometimes he says at the very end of his video for a few seconds that he was uh, paid paid to promote, um, or he's paid to talk about this. Or sometimes he doesn't even say he's paid to talk about it. He just said this was a paid promotion. And he doesn't say he's, who he's paid by or for, for what he was paid for. He doesn't say any of that. So a lot of times he's very deceptive about it, but he gets paid to promote these penny stocks. A lot of them. Some of them he doesn't even, I don't know if he gets paid to promote. I, I couldn't tell you really because he doesn't really disclose it all too uh, all too well. He doesn't do a great job of disclosing it. So, I mean, he's got some of these. Um, sometimes he'll say ad in here, but he won't even talk about it in his video. He won't say he was uh, paid for them. Sometimes he'll maybe write that he was uh, uh, paid for it down here. Sometimes he'll just put ad in there and then he'll put for like two seconds in the video. Uh, this was I was uh, this video was sponsored, but he doesn't say who he was paid by or why he was paid or what 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 not. You know, I mean, he doesn't say any of that. So we got a few videos. I mean, I'll just show you some of these like uh, big change for this. I don't, I'm not saying he was paid by all by all these companies. Some of them maybe he wasn't paid and he, maybe he was just pumping these little penny stocks. Some of them are shell companies too that he's uh, promoted, like a, a very small, like we're talking under 10,000 market cap. You can move those very easily, like under 10,000 market caps, $10,000. I mean, how much money do you have? Do you think you, you can move something that has a $10,000 valuation? If you put a thousand dollars in there, right? And you at a $10,000 valuation, you would own actually like 10% of the company. So, I mean, I don't know. Maybe he could move some of these. Maybe he could. Uh, I don't know. Maybe he's pumping them up for some reason. I don't know. I couldn't tell you. I have no clue. I have no clue, but uh, let's see. We got some of these videos. Us, uh, I don't know. It says ad here, but I don't know. Does he say it in the video? I don't know. Sometimes he does. Sometimes he doesn't. He's very, uh, very deceptive about that. In my opinion, I guess. Right? Not financial advice, bro. Right? Not financial advice. Got this. I mean, I don't know. It doesn't say, does it say here? Maybe he was. Maybe he was paid by them. I don't know. Was he? Oh, disclaimer. This video was sponsored by a third-party company, as mentioned in the video. So, okay, this one he didn't mention in the video. Some he doesn't even put it in the description that it was, you know, sponsored by a third-party. I don't know. Some he does. Some he doesn't. He's very, uh, I would say, deceptive about that. Uh, let's see. Oh, another one here. Was he paid by them? I don't know. Was he? Next big company. So, it's a disclaimer. There's affiliation links. I don't know. Maybe he was. Maybe he was just talking about it. I don't know. M-A-S-N. I don't know. What What is this company even? I don't know. A lot of them are shell companies. I mean... It's very interesting stuff. Oh, gee, has a market cap of $187,000. Gee, he couldn't move that. This is a very trustworthy guy right here. His financial journey got very trustworthy. Oh, another one. How high could a, uh, oh, C-O-S-M, squeeze. Oh, gee, wow. I mean, I trust this guy, man. He's definitely not trying to pump these stocks up. He's not getting paid to pump a lot of these stocks up. But uh, I don't know, man. I mean, let's see. Could he? I don't know. Maybe he is. Disclaimer. I mean, I don't know. How high could it go? Doesn't say... Here, does he go over it in the video? I don't know. Maybe he was paid by them. Maybe he wasn't. Maybe he's just pumping it for himself. Maybe he's just doing DD. He's just showing you guys. He's just being a very nice guy with no um, ulterior motive, I guess, right? Oh, gee, I'll be going over. Uh, let's see. I'll be going over Global Compliance Corp. Wow, that's amazing. This guy is awesome. Wow, we're going over Global Compliance Corp. A lot of times, too, he likes to talk about how great the website is or the industry is. Gee, oh, this one, this one's not as bad, I guess. It's, uh, it's almost six million market cap. That's that's a lot better, right? At least it's six million, not you know, one hundred eighty-seven thousand. Oh, gee, this video was conducted on behalf of Brian Sell and paid for by Norris Equities Corp. Whoa, gee, so it's on behalf of this company and paid for by this company. I mean, wow. Oh, gee, wow. So he was paid. Oh, this video was sponsored, but he talks very positive about it, right? So he must mean it, right? I mean, I don't know. I don't know. Oh, pink status stock. Two short squeeze coming. Wow, wow. This is amazing stuff. I love this guy. Disclaimer. There may be affiliate links. Disclaimer. Oh, to the buddies. To, I mean, I don't know. Maybe he was paid by them. Maybe he wasn't. I don't know. Oh, Winnipeg. Oh, he's in Canada. That's a great. Yeah, great. Wow. MDCN. Price prediction. Merger. 1800X. Wow, that's amazing. Oh, SEC filing there. Wow, he's, wow he put an SEC filing there. Wow, how nice of him being, oh, being that nice and transparent. Wow. Absolutely amazing guy. This guy is awesome. Oh, so nice. Oh, EEGI, price prediction, huge move coming for EEGI. Oh, gee, what is this? $3,461 market cap. Amazing. That's so amazing. Wow. It's awesome. I love this guy. This guy's amazing. I'm invested. Pump and dump. LL working. <laughs> 
Wow. Oh, pimp and dump. He says pimp and dump. Wow. Why did you promote a fake stock? Oh, it isn't fake. I was researching. Nothing led me to think this was a fraudulent company in any way. <laughs> wow. Okay. At least some people are calling him out for it. I mean, wow. Disclaimer. Oh, I'm not a financial advisor. Don't come after me. Don't sue me, bro. I'm not a financial advisor. Don't sue me, bro. I mean, there's probably more. Some of them, I don't know. I mean, some of them, I guess he says he was paid for. Some, I don't know if he was paid for. Some, some he says in the video. Some, he just has a little text come up for a few seconds. But I, I don't know. I just, uh, I'd be careful watching this guy. I'd be careful trusting this guy. He has a Patreon too, you know. I mean, I don't know. I'd be uh, very, uh, very careful. Oh, he's also, what was his latest one? Uh, Nev Gold. Oh, we got Nev Gold here. He says, so I watched this, and I watched this video. Uh, I read the financials. He says the financials were sound. The company three extra shares outstanding in like a year because they need to raise capital. So why do why do companies pay to have their uh, stock promoted? Well, they want to get new investors in to buy the stock to raise the price up, so they can issue more shares at a higher price to raise capital. That's basically why they do it. I mean, the permit process. Yeah, I mean this is a. Uh, Wow, this is amazing. Hey, it says ad here. doesn't say in this description, uh, I've read it. He doesn't say, oh, I was paid by them. But he says for a few seconds, he says for a few seconds, it was sponsored. I'll show you here. It's like uh, right towards the end, it says this video was sponsored. Under the OTC. He, so once again, let me know you thoughts and all that in the comments below. And without further ado, oh, I appreciate you guys this watching. video was sponsored. You see how quick that text uh, came up for? Oh, wow. See how quick that text came up for? Like two or three seconds? And that's it. That's all he does. He puts, oh, hashtag ad though too. He put hashtag ad. Yeah, see? Wow. So that's not being deceptive at all, right guys? That's not being deceptive. I mean, this guy's a totally legit, trustworthy guy. Yeah, very high, a guy of high character and high morale. But, uh, yeah, I don't know. Thanks for watching. Tell me your thoughts down below. You still like this guy? Is he a great guy? Very nice guy. He's Canadian, right? He's Canadian. I think he is, right? So he's got to be a nice guy, right? You totally, I mean, I, I trust this guy, but uh, yeah, tell me your thoughts down below and thanks for watching.